Have you ever tried to use feet and inches in Grasshopper? Well, we created a cool component for that. It will let you convert those tricky feet and inches into decimal digits that Grasshopper loves, regardless of your writing format. Stick around till the end and see how to make one yourself. As we all know, Grasshopper is all about those number sliders and panels. That's how it takes number inputs for its parametric algorithms. The catch? It's metric-centric. Sorry to the feet and inch squad out there, especially our pals in Liberia, Myanmar and US. But I said, hold up, wait a minute. We got a neat workaround to get those feet, inches and even those tiny fractional bits into Grasshopper compatible decimals. And guess what? It's totally doable. Imagine you got this mix of imperial values in different formats. Pop them in our decimal converter and bam! You got decimal outputs in feet, inches and even meters for the metric users. Ready to dive in? Here's a quick how-to. First, place each value in a separate branch. Categorize them based on if they contain feet. If they do, separate those feet from inches. Use single quotation mark as a separator. Index 0 contains feet. Index 1 contains inches. Replace any nulls in the feet section with a 0. And if data doesn't exist, replace with a 0 as well. Kick out the inch values that are just zeros using a pattern from the text match once again got some empty values, eliminate them with the member index component, use an empty panel to identify them and with the call index they will be removed. Once we clean up the list, we'll trim tree in order to match the data with another list of inches from the beginning and merge these two lists into one. Replace any dashes with spaces, so we're all speaking the same format language. A little more cleaning, get rid of any white space at the beginning. Now split the inches from the fraction using a space. The first item is your inches, the second is your fractions. Alright, this is where things get interesting. Convert those numbers into decimals with the number container, then sum them with the mass addition. And for the grand finale in inches, multiply those feet values by 12 and add the inches we just processed. Result in feet is more your thing, no problem, just divide the inch result by 12 and add it to the feet list. For the metric users, transform inches to meters with a little multiplication by 0.0254. Want to go a step further? Make this component your own with Grasshopper clusters. First, add cluster input, Rename it with a quick double tap, then add cluster outputs for each final value. Name them something descriptive so you can easily know what they represent. Select all, right click, hit cluster. In order to place it among other components, you need to select the cluster and go to file, create user object name it and in the category section select in which tab the icon will appear and voila open a new file and your brand new component is ready for action in the extended tutorial we are going to create an imperial unit decimal generator instead of typing stuff just tweak the input sliders and get the value you want this you can watch on our patreon page and while you're there throw us a little love and support You'll also unlock our full library of extended tutorials and project files. Take care.